So, after last week's drive problems, we've overcome that with a more heavy duty and upgraded drive shaft mechanism. So now, as uh, requested by a few loyal disciples, they wanted to see some gear changes and lost finger ends, so there goes. Right, so, that's the Start the reverse. Dog ears, off the dog box. Yeah. Alright, so that's gone in reverse. Okay. And now we're going to go for the big shifts. Not in motion. So that's reverse. So crawler will be opposite reverse if we can get some purchase on it. Not much oil on it now, I can't Right, so that now is in this gear which is low crawler. So we'll pull it out of crawler into neutral. First gear. Right, I can't do it though, can I? Oh yeah, that's right. Here we go. Ready? 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 Neutral. Double in the clutch. No, okay, you've got to stop. So that one is third. Right. Done in this gear track. Get in the distance now. Four. Which is which is actually one turn of the drill to one turn of the main shaft. It's not running through these gears now, it's just running straight through. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. It's all oiling up. Good as gold. Much to Johnny's relief. Much to my relief. I do all that shit again. So, when you're in neutral, all the gears are turning in constant mesh, hence the term constant mesh, but the main shaft, which is to the prop shaft, is not demonstration Johnny. There you go. So the main shaft isn't turning at all to engage your dog's foot. And when you get that horrible grinding noise, it's that. If you haven't timed it right to get it in gear. And also the auxiliary unit doesn't turn unless it's in gear. Yeah. Shine. In neutral that ain't running. Yeah. I'll just stick it in a gear. Yeah, that's it. Demonstration over. So, operation of the range change. Got it? Hold on, hold on. Yeah.